So Franklin Gomez, Frank Molinero, Gomez won an NCAA title at Michigan State. And that was back in 2009. Had a couple third place finishes there. 2011 world silver medalist is Franklin Gomez. He finished seventh in 2013 this past year. And Frank Molinero, fresh off an NYAC victory in 2013. Also NCAA champion in 2012 for Penn State. Uh, Molinero is an assistant coach at Rutgers right now. So we are scoreless about a minute into the match. So Gomez comes in, three wins on the day. Tech fall over Brett Robbins in the opening round. Tech fall over Drew Headley in the quarters. 8-2 decision over Boris Novotkov in the semis. Molinero, three victories on the day as well. 10-8 decision in the first round over Gao of China. Injury default over Amiev in the quarters. And a 3-1 decision over Jason Chamberlain in the semis. So we have passive on Molinero. He'll go on the shot clock. We're going to break this deadlock one way or the other. So that will be a caution against Molinero. Point for Gomez. I had an error on the scoreboard there. Got it corrected. It is 1-0 Gomez. Under a minute now to go in the first. Gomez working wrist control, two on one. Things starting to pick up a little bit. So that'll be it for the first. No takedowns, just one point on the shot clock violation. So Gomez leading it. I have a quick break here. Molinero charging in right off the whistle. Takes that center mat position. And close to a push out there.
Molinaro with a little shot attempt there. Counter nicely. The official stopping the match, warning them about clasping the fingers. So we're going to have a warning there on Gomez. I believe that's his first one, not on the shot clock as of yet. Molinaro keeps up this pace. We could see Gomez on the shot clock shortly. Now a shot from Molinaro. Front headlock now for Gomez. Close to the edge here. Staying down on the mat, back up to the feet. Molinaro in deep now on the single, trying to get the takedown. Gomez, great hips there, able to counter. Hip heist out of that. Back up to the feet. And another one of those, and I'm pretty sure Gomez is going to be on the clock, judging by the reactions of the mat officials. And we have it. Gomez on the clock. So Franklin Gomez has 30 seconds to score. Molinero will tie it up at one and actually have criteria advantage via last point scored. You see that blast double right in the chest of Molinero, able to take it. No points, 15 seconds on the clock. Molinaro hanging on that head. Back up to the feet. There's five seconds remaining on the shot clock. 109 left in the match. So if Molinaro can fend off Gomez for five seconds, Molinaro will tie things up at one apiece. And he does. So one minute left. Gomez is going to have to score. Actually, Molinero was in the exact same situation in his semifinal match against Chamberlain. Was tied up one apiece. Molinero had that shot clock tiebreaker criteria. And he was able to get a takedown at the end off a Chamberlain shot. That was forced simply because it had to be. So 35 seconds now. Let's see what Gomez has in the tank. We know he has it in him. Another world silver medalist. And he's in deep on the shot. Chest lock for Molinero. Back up to the feet. Outside shot from Gomez. Heavy hands from Molinero. Gomez shot attempt again, 10 seconds. Snapping. Four, three, two, one, time. And Molinero goes out. Time had expired. Almost positive. We're going to get a challenge no matter what. So they're saying they can't challenge the time. We have it on our video, but they can't challenge it. No, it wasn't. It's out of time. I'm going to go back and watch, though, just for fun.